everyone, happy Monday. It is grocery haul meal plan day. I will have my meal plan at the second part of this grocery haul. This is just a midweek grocery haul. I knew we were gonna need a couple of things this week and I had to go to Target anyway to get cheese for pizza night. This is the cheese we like for um, pizza night. So I ended up having to go there to get this. Our HEB does not have this kind of cheese. I thought while I was there, I would get things we were gonna need next week anyway. So it's actually Friday. So all that to say, I will have our weekly meal plan on the second half of this video. So I did end up getting a really, really good cartwheel deal. Olivia has recently started loving gummy snacks. So we've been getting these ones and the Annie's bunnies. And so these ones happen to be on sale for $2.50 this week, which was 49 cents off. And then there was a 10% off Target um, cartwheel thing. So if you have the cartwheel app, um, you can get 10% off of these as well. So that made them $2.25, but they missed some of the, they ended up missing some of the cartwheel deals. So I was looking at my receipt and some of them weren't marked off. So I had to go back in, I had to go to customer service and they gave me that $1.50 refund. Make sure you're just looking at your receipt to make sure you get those cartwheel deals. Sometimes, you know, they just mess up. That's the first time I've had a cartwheel deal not come off but they were really easy about returning it. It was no hassle at all. So I ended up with 10 of these. It has six in the box. So this will last a really long time. Um, so I checked the dates on them. These pomegranate ones were till April and then the uh, strawberry ones were till February. Let's see, I got mostly of the pomegranate ones since they'll last longer. And then I also got the strawberry fruit bites, but she absolutely just goes crazy for these. Of course, they're really sugary, but I limit them. So she has a few of these throughout the week as it's just a special treat for her. So I will have to hide these because she already had one in the store and wanted them like the whole time we were in the store because she saw those. But anyway, enough about that. Let's go ahead and move on. I've got some apples, I got some raspberries. She really loves raspberries. Some bananas for snacking. Some of the whole milk mozzarella for our pizza night tonight. That was the whole reason I ended up going. Then some applesauce again. She's been really liking the applesauce lately. Um, some mushrooms for pizza night. I usually have pepperoni and olives, but sometimes I like mushrooms too. So I'm gonna put mushrooms on there. And then I also got some unsalted butter. We're gonna do some baking and then some string cheese. She really likes this mozzarella. I'm not sure if she'll dig this, but I thought it'd be another little snack we could try. On nights that we have something I know she's not gonna like, I like to give her fish sticks. I just used up the last ones in that small box we got a while back. And then we also needed some tissues. So I got a four pack of those. So I did spend $55.97 and then I got $1.50 back. So um, not too bad. So this is the second half of my grocery haul. I did already put the cold stuff away, so I will show you that clip now. I got a block of Colby Jack cheese, some deli chicken, some cream bars, some milk, some sour cream, and two things of yogurt. And then I'll walk you through. We just needed mostly fresh stuff. So I got some matchstick carrots. We still have some broccoli. I'll make some roasted carrots and broccoli for some sides this week. Some zucchini for a couple of different recipes. Some avocados. I had tortilla soup most of this week. Absolutely loved it. I'm gonna make another batch for this coming up week. So I like avocado in my soup. I asked them to get some green ones so that they'll you know, ripen throughout the week, hopefully at different times. Then I got some olives and some garbanzo beans. Olivia still loves both of those. We got some green onions and some cilantro, a bunch of bananas. I'm gonna be making banana pudding. So I also got the vanilla wafers and the cheesecake pudding for that. And I was making dirt tonight. Olivia really, Olivia really didn't like the chocolate. She doesn't like chocolate anything really. So I went ahead and made this and let her have a little bit of it tonight. And I'll make the banana pudding tomorrow. Then I have a lime, some apples, some potatoes, some bacon bits. We're gonna do baked potatoes this week. So these are gonna be for Johnny to top his baked potato. That's the only thing he likes on baked potatoes. So I wanted to make sure I got him something. I won't eat these because I'm pretty sure they'll have nitrates in them. Yep. And then I also got him some saltines for snacking. I'm pretty sure I spent about $50, so that'll make the total around $100 for the week, which I don't think is bad at all. So here is a look at our meal plan for this week. We're gonna have steak. I never ended up using any of that top sirloin that I had picked up at HEB quite a while back. It's been in the freezer, so I'm gonna have that with green beans and baked potatoes, and then we'll do baked chicken and broccoli. I'm gonna do a couple of split chicken breasts that we won't eat all of, but I'll use them for the next one to two nights. We'll do chicken stir fry. I was thinking ramen, since we have a bunch of ramen noodles still left to use up. And so if that carries over with leftovers, we'll have leftovers on Thursday. 
and otherwise we'll just get some takeout. We haven't had takeout in a while. Then Friday we'll have pizza and then I carried over the veggie stew from last week. We didn't end up making it so it'll be veggie beef stew. I got us huge steaks so whatever steak we don't eat I'll cut up and freeze and then put it in the um the veggie stew and so for the weekend breakfast I got hash browns for this week. We used up I'm pretty sure we used up the last pack of bacon. We've also got some um, frozen biscuits and we've got plenty of eggs we can make omelets and stuff and then for lunches I'm gonna have tortilla soup again I just absolutely loved it this week basically I just throw whatever veggies I've got in there and I got the cilantro and the lime and I got the cilantro and the lime to flavor it up a little bit so I'll use the zucchini in the ramen and I'll also use zucchini in that tortilla soup um, but that is it for this week hope you guys enjoyed it give me a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe and that's my oil diffuser if you see <laughs> there's smoke coming out of it it's just the oil mist hope you guys have a great week and I'll catch you guys next time Bye.